QuickBooks can easily and quickly connect with all of your bank accounts online, so you'll always have access to the most up-to-date information about your business's health. This video will show you how to make sure your accounts are connected to QuickBooks, how you can categorize transactions and run reports. Connecting your bank and credit card accounts to QuickBooks eliminates time-consuming data entry and keeps your business's books up to date all the time. To connect your bank, start by selecting Banking from the navbar and then select Add Account. Enter the name of your bank or credit card company and then select it from the drop-down list. Each bank has its own process and security features and may require a few more steps. In general, you would choose your bank and enter the username and password you use to access that account from the bank's website. It may take a couple of minutes for your bank to connect to QuickBooks. Now you see all the accounts you have at this bank. Choose the account that you use for your business and tell QuickBooks what type of accounts they are. QuickBooks connects to your accounts and downloads all of the transactions for the last 90 days. If you want to download data for more than 90 days, then select the drop-down. If you don't see the option you want, select Custom and enter the date. When you are ready, select Connect. It's important to note that these transactions aren't in QuickBooks yet. You can easily sort these transactions with QuickBooks help. First, click on the Category or Match column to sort the transactions. You'll see where QuickBooks tried to find categories for some transactions. If you agree with the category QuickBooks gave a transaction, click Add. To put your transaction in a different category, open the menu and choose the right category. In QuickBooks, a category for money spent needs to be assigned to an expense account. For example, this expense was at a cafe, so it should be a meals and entertainment expense. Now that you've connected your accounts and know how to categorize transactions, it's time to take a more in-depth look at how your business is performing. The most important information for any business is to see what you're really making and spending. You can get a summary of this right here on your dashboard. You can also run reports like the Profit and Loss Report, which will show you more detail about where you're spending the majority of your business's money or receiving your income. You can even see your expenses as a percentage of your income. In order to get the percentage of income view, you need to customize the report. This is very helpful in understanding where your money is going. For example, there are a number of reports you can run to get a better sense of how your business is performing. You can even customize any of these reports to show exactly the information you need. Now, get started.